Novamusic.com. Hey everybody, what's happening? Rob Marcella here at Nova Music in beautiful Milwaukee. And today we're going to check out the brand new Roland GF55 guitar synthesizer. Uh, the GF55 is the 10th generation of guitar synths from Roland. And Roland invented the very first one a uh, long, long time ago. And what we have today is really an amazing piece. All right, so now let's talk about some of the features of the GF55. Uh, first of all, we have over 900 of the latest and greatest amazing sound of Roland synthesizer sounds built in. And these are, of course, totally tweakable and editable. So, I mean, there's a lot of possibilities here. Uh, we also have basically a Roland VG99 built in and uh, the VG99 technology lets you model any kind of guitar pretty much in the world or bass or banjo or sitar um, electronically. And we're going to talk about that a little later. I can also blend in my uh, magnetic pickups, my, my regular guitar pickups. So I can have a total of four sounds playing at any given time. So this is really, really a powerful piece and uh, you can come up with some really, really amazing stuff with it. A couple of other things I want to talk about is um, we have an onboard built-in audio player um, on the side here. I don't know if you can see it on the screen, but there's a little slot for a USB flash drive. And uh, on that flash drive, you can have all your backing tracks and also your patch data. So let's say you're going to travel across the world. You don't have to bring your actual GR55, which you can just bring your flash drive and whenever you arrive where you're going, you just pop in your flash drive in the GR55 over there and uh, it takes about three seconds and all your patches and everything is loaded in so it's very convenient. Another very cool thing we can do with the GR55 is on top of the four sounds that we can have playing from the GR simultaneously we can also go into any other synthesizer or keyboard or synth module and trigger those sounds as well so it's really limitless what you can do. So you could trigger, you know, if you have like a favorite old synth module or something, you could just trigger that now with your guitar. And uh, for me, that's amazing because I'm not a very good keyboard player at all, but I can now do it with the guitar, so that's awesome. Guitar players often ask me about the tracking speed, and uh, I've played a lot of guitar synths over the years, but the GF55 is hands down the most amazingly fast thing I've ever come across. And it's super accurate, super fast, and this is because of Roland's brand new pitch detection technology. And uh, it's really remarkable. The GR55 also works for bass. There's two modes in here. We have guitar mode and bass mode. If you set it to bass mode and you plug in your bass, you get a whole new set of different patches. And uh, of course, the lightning fast tracking and playing accuracy is just as great for the bass. So all you bass players out there can also enjoy the amazing guitar synthesis of the GR. All right, now let's check out some patches. The first one I want to show you is like a rock lead type organ. It's one of the many organ sounds in here, but I really like this one because it has that nasty rock 70s organ feel. And it sounds like this. <laughs> Here's uh, another cool patch. This is a 12-string acoustic guitar with a church organ underneath it, and it goes like this. Alright, this next patch is another really cool one. On this patch, I can control the synthesizer filter with my pick attack, and it could sound like this. <laughs> This next example is a clean guitar with a keyboard bell sound 
and I'm going to use the expression pedal to fade the keyboard sound in and out and it could sound like this This next patch is a piano patch and here again I'm using the VG technology to tune my A string up a minor third to C so I can use it as an open string and it goes like this. Here's another cool patch, and, and on this patch, whenever I play a note, it's going to add a keyboard pad underneath it, and it's really cool. It sounds like this, and this is a great patch for your big arena rock intro solo, and it goes like this. Okay, here's like a really old, nasty synth bass kind of sound. Okay, here's some really rich, big, and uh, fat strings. Alright, here's another cool one. This is actually a recorder with an acoustic guitar and it could sound like this. Okay, now I'm going to show you how you could use the GR in a musical context. I'm going to play a short song, go through a lot of different patches, and uh, for this song, I tuned my guitar down uh, a step and a half electronically because thanks to the VG technology, you can tune each string up or down two octaves. So you can come up with all kinds of crazy tunings that you could never really do if you, you know, use your regular tuning machines because you'd probably pop every string on if you try to, you know, tune them up an octave each uh, or two. And uh, we also ha in here have a bunch of uh, preset tunings as well, you know, open G, open E, dadgad, Nashville tuning, baritone, all that stuff. But you can also, of course, come up with all your own cool, crazy tunings. And um, it's very powerful. So just to give you an idea, this is what my guitar sounds like by itself. And now I'm just going to go to my other patch, and here, here it is, the same thing, detuned. Sounds perfect, and I don't even have to touch my tuners here. Um, so anyways, I'm going to play this song using the onboard audio player and it goes like this.
Is that good?